all right what is up everyone i'm very excited about this video if you have not seen my unboxing video go check this out this is just a quick video test it's kind of getting dark outside on the jvc everio uh, gz hm35 i think is what it's called so let's just test out the zoom this does have a 40 by optical zoom on it and this just came out of the box so i have not messed with any of the settings so this is in intelligent auto mode I think as you can see it's kind of hard to hold it steady let's just zoom in down here to these houses this is all the way the max zoom on it so you can see that is plenty enough zoom to get you close to whatever you want to be near so now let's just walk around um, and see how the video looks. It's us shoot in 1080p HD video. So you can see, wow, that focuses in pretty nicely. I think it does have a macro mode. I don't know if that's on or what. But I am super close to this. You can see exactly how well this thing focuses. And for the price tag of $129, and that does come with a SD card, a 8 GB SD card, I mean, you can't really complain about the quality if it's not perfect. Uh, the stabilization seems to be working out pretty good on walking right now, and it does not seem to be shaky at all. So that looks to be turning out pretty good. Uh, let's get up close to this grass right here, and... You can see that does look very good. So we're gonna walk over here to this old building. Now, if y'all were gonna buy this off the Walmart website, it does say that it uh, has built-in Wi-Fi and a touch screen and can take um, still pictures. They messed up in that ad. This is not a camcorder that has touchscreen built-in Wi-Fi or that can take still pictures. It's just a video recorder. It's not going to have all them fancy features for the low price um, that this camcorder is. And I have to say, just by looking at it now, uh, the video seems like it was really worth it. And you can't complain. So let's just pan around here. It does have face detection and stabilization and everything. It does seem to have a pretty wide angle lens on it. The reason I'm doing this video test and I'm going to do kind of a series of video tests in different situations like right now, it's kind of a low light test. The reason I'm doing this is because when I was getting ready to buy this camera, um, there was no reviews on YouTube about it. There was one guy who had some uh, video tests but they weren't fantastic so I'm like right on the pavement you can see just how good that looks you can see focus time is pretty quick so yeah that is the reason that I am doing this video so I hope y'all like it if y'all were thinking about buying this camcorder and the video test uh, made you want to buy it even more then leave that down in the comments below and if you have any questions about it you can put that down in the comments below too and I will answer that and if you do have this camcorder tell me how you think the video is on it
it does take an hour and 15 minutes for this battery to charge up and it does last I think 40 minutes so if you're gonna be using this to film a concert of course this is not gonna be too good for doing that but if you're gonna be using it at home to do unboxing videos reviews or stuff like that you can connect the adapter and or the charger actually it plugs into the side of the camcorder so you don't take the battery out and put it into a little cradle to charge it you can use that adapter to um power the camcorder so you don't have to just go off the battery so that's a very nice feature that i like because i don't want to sit there and have the battery run out on me in the middle of a video and then have to redo the whole thing again so you can hear the microphone on this camcorder now uh, you can hear what it sounds like the wind's blowing so you can kind of see how well it blocks out the wind and how well it picks up my voice and the microphone is on the front of this camcorder so I'm just trying to get some close-up shots on some stuff so you can see how this camcorder performs So I think this is going to about wrap up my video test, or one of my video tests. Uh, subscribe for more of these and tell me in the comments any other videos you would like me to do if you're thinking about buying this camera and you want to see some different tests and I'll be more than happy to do them. So yeah, like I said, thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. That helps a lot. And subscribe if you want more videos like this. So thanks for watching.